and tools to hand out tracts and um, pray for people if they want prayer and whatever. The second Saturday, we're going to do home visitation. We'll meet at 6 o'clock at the church and we'll go out to different places to uh, visit. We're planning on visiting Brother Dick, who uh, we all love so dearly. And uh, if you want to be a part of that, just, we'll, we'll get together and let you know what's happening prior to uh, the second Saturday. And the third Saturday, we always have breakfast at the Cracker Barrel at 6 a.m. in the morning. And this coming Saturday, which is the fourth Saturday of every month, we are uh, planning on having a leadership class. So our leadership class will be this Saturday at 6.30 p.m. here at the church. Just want to thank, uh, I think his name is Johnny, Johnny and Faith, who are Israel's children, for being with us today. I love that name, Faith. Mary is his mom, and his name is Israel. Praise the Lord. <laughs> so thank you guys for coming, and please come back and visit us again. Also, what I did, I ran off some copies of all the members' names and phone numbers that I have. I may not have all of them, uh, but I thought, you know, maybe you could get a copy if you want one, and you can call each other. You know, maybe somebody's in your spirit to pray with them, or for whatever reason, you know, you just call them and tell them how much you love them. And if you want to do that, I have copies of the members' names and numbers here. You can take one of these. Also, it's good to see Lisa with her smiling, beautiful face here with us today. Amen. Amen. And I think, you know, um, Monday we still talking, we have the marriage class here, uh, getting ready to talk about raising godly children. Uh, it would be important for everybody to come out and attend these, uh, the Raising God and Children because we all come in contact with children at one point in our lives. Even if you don't have your own children, you're going to uh, have some impact on a child's life. So if you want to come out on Monday, it starts at 6 p.m. and it's just for one hour only. And of course, we have our Bible study on Tuesday and our prayer and uh, intercessory teaching on Thursday. So I think that's all of my announcements. Uh, make sure you love on somebody before you leave. Love on uh, Dr. Don and Reverend Paula and tell them how much you love them. Pastor's going to come up and close us out. I just want to say please be mindful that they're praying as you exit the building so that you don't disturb them. But if you'd like to wait and you know, love on them, that's fine. Uh, but if you need to go, then you can be dismissed to go. Just uh, go quietly if you don't mind. Or if you want to talk a lot, maybe go to the next side of the building there. We love you. If you still would like prayer, he's, they're still up here praying, so come and get prayer before you leave. That's what we're here for. We love you all so much. Thank you for coming out. And every one of you, I love seeing these smiling faces on Sunday so much. I can't tell you all kind of blessed to me coming here. Father, you got some other? I just wanted to say, then you look handsome in this yeah. room. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know who picked your name, me, man. <laughs> Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you for this time together. Thank you for these people that have been ministered to. Thank you for Dr. Don and all the churches you oversee in the ministry. Thank you that, Father God, we can have a part in these things. And Lord, we thank you for the privilege to come and hear your word in a free country. And we thank you, Father, in Jesus' name, right now, in the name of Jesus, that your blessing rests upon all this church family, Lord, as they exit this place. And that they go and win souls this week and bring them back next Sunday. Jesus' name. God bless you. We love you.